the Namibia Fish Consumption Promotion Trust Financial Manager, Cornelius Iambo, explained that the survey results will serve as a guide for the trust's mandate to improve the affordability and availability of fish locally. The importance of this is for us to be able to know where we are. Um, if we, our efforts of promoting and accessing and making it affordable, the fish affordable, if it's actually having the desired effect. Um, now, this information um, is also going to be the information that we received from the survey. We are going to use it to, to actually develop strategies that will uh, uh, improve the, the, the level of our consumption um, of fish which mostly will cover the education part, especially um, which the, the survey have actually um, uh, given us those results. According to UNAM's lecturer at the Katima Mulilo campus, Dr. Evan Simasiku Kamwi, the current most preferred fish in the Zambezi region is tilapia. Simasiku said tilapia is less in Zambezi shops, and the survey outcome seeks to collaborate with willing suppliers to get more tilapia onto shelves. We've explored some of the challenges in terms of pricing, availability, and uh, possibly uh, the distribution of fish countrywide. But then it has also become quite evident that the locally preferred indigenous species, they are currently unavailable in the fish shops here in the Zambezi region. However, the, uh, the suppliers are actually willing to find a reliable source tilapia, which is quite challenging. At the moment they are selling a, a Nile tilapia, which is not a preference. And so far we had intense discussions in terms of looking out for suppliers of these indigenous species because they are the most preferable species. In addition, UNAM senior researcher Martin Kasanga explained that research is meant to produce accurate results that can help with policy and decision making. This was, uh, we really appreciate the fact that the, the fish consumption, the Namibia Fish Consumption Promotion Trust, they saw it very uh, important for them to have evident base that should inform their operation, that should inform their day-to-day uh, running of the activity. So what they did is that they outsourced this service, uh, the, serv the research service, and the university uh, procedurally we tendered for this and then we got the, 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 we were commissioned to do this study on their behalf. So we did this study, we produced empirical evidence for them to help them uh, in, running, in, in fulfilling their mandates. And now today, it's also, I think maybe this is also the message to other um, potential funders, no, but potential future research funders.